And what made you decide, I'm going to ask you the question again, what made you decide to do this, start this? I think there was just an outpouring of support from the running community in uh, around the world. And, uh, you know, Run for Water, we're a run. We, we put on a run every year to raise money for clean water projects in Ethiopia. And, and yet the runners amongst us were, were passionate to just say we want to support uh, runners everywhere and, and in particular what's happened in Boston um, and the tragedy that's there to say we want to come out we want to we want to not be afraid we want to say we can still get together and we can still run and we can still be together as a society of humans that aren't going to um, you know react and fall to this this challenge by whoever it was to, to bring fear and and uh, you know, to our community as a whole and to society. As a whole. So, what made you decide to run to come out to this? Uh, to show support for a really tragic event that happened in Boston yesterday. And have you ever run in the Boston Marathon? I have indeed. I ran last year for the first time. And uh, the one thing I remember the most is uh, the spectators. They were the thing that I mem remember the most about the whole race. And uh, to see harm done to them just breaks my heart. And can you name is spell? Uh, when when a couple of us on Run for Water board said, you know, what what can we do to respond to the tragedy yesterday? The idea was, let's run, let's have a moment of silence, let's remember the tragedy that happened, but let's let's run. Running is about freedom. It's about uh, experiencing the outdoors, and uh, the tragedy that we saw unfold before us yesterday was about everything opposite to freedom. So. Today, uh, Run for Water, it's a privilege for us to say, let's, let's come together, let's remember those that uh, were affected by that tragedy, and, uh, and then let's embrace life and, and, and run.